The venue was the Mount Prisgah Spiritual Baptist Church in Chagonas, where friends and family members gathered to remember the late Dexter St. Louis, who passed away suddenly in Bordeaux, France, back on May 16th, surrounded by his wife and two daughters. Dexter was widely remembered for his relentless work ethic, sense of humor, and passion for justice, as well as for his honesty, fair play, and his open and transparent approach to sport and to life. Dexter was a great one. He was a great one. He was a great. He was a ex, He was principal. He was decent. He was dedicated. He was a great family man. Um, and he was a great friend. The current president of the Table Tennis Association, David Joseph, also commended St. Louis for his passion for the sport and the role he played in its development over the years. St. Louis' mother, Prudence, was proud of her son's achievements, even though she admitted to being skeptical about his chosen career path at first. Dexter gave his life for this game, as you know. So, we, all we did was to support him. His father used to question him, if this is what you want, I am there for you all the time. And at first I didn't want it. I wanted him to finish with the school. But he didn't want that. He wanted time to practice and whatever. That's about it. And no matter what you tell him, that is where his mind was. He started from about 11 years old, taking a knock and see. And from 15 years old, as you said, he launched up. And his parents stood with him. He never gave up on it. Anything he want, sometimes I mean, but uh, you know, but the father said, if he does what he want, I am going to help him. And as he used to say, he has never left me though. Dexter died after a short illness and leaves to mourn his wife Jeromeen and two daughters, Ryan Chung and Oxel. He remains to date the only TNT table tennis player to qualify for two Olympic Games in 1996 and 2008. Ruskin Mark, TDT Sports.